we, all, we want to look at to, to determine if an equation is a function. And in order to find out if that's the case, we need to go ahead and solve for y and see, do we get only one solution for y? Or do we get two or multiple solutions for y? So in this case, let's go ahead and solve this equation for y. I'll subtract x squared from both sides. And performing one operation, I see that I get one solution for y. y equals four minus x squared. So therefore, I can determine that this original equation is indeed a function. But you're asking, well, okay, what's not a function? Well, let's look a little bit. And let's modify this equation by providing a y squared right there. And it could, be, it could have been any equation I've done. This one was just easier because I already had it written on the board. So I have x squared plus y squared equals 4. Again, let's solve for y. And I'll start the same way. I'll subtract x squared from both sides. I'll get y squared equals 4 minus x squared. The equation is not solved for y yet. It's solved for y squared. So the next step is I need to go ahead and take the square root of both sides. When I do that, I'm left with y equals 4 minus x squared, the square root of that, with a plus or minus out in front. In this case, I get y equals positive 4 minus x squared, or the square root of 4 minus x squared, or negative square root of 4 minus x squared. And so for some values of y in this particular equation, I get two answers. And so therefore, that particular equation is not a function.